On the last night of summer, we get the first Ivy League football matchup of 2023. 130 years after their first meeting, Harvard and Brown look to stay perfect on the young season. Isaiah Reed in that defensive backfield, one of the best defensive backs in the Ivy League on third down. It's intercepted, picked off by Ethan Royer, spins down at the 35-yard line. And Brown on cue with a turnover forced on Harvard's opening drive. It's Jordan DeLucia in the backfield with Wilcox. They just get the snap off, looking to the right side. It's caught for a first down. And it is Graham Walker with his first catch of the night coverage by Gavin Shipman. Lucier will have Owen behind him in the short pistol. Direct snap to Owen, rushing up the middle, and he will be in for a touchdown. Far side official signaled, and Stockton Owen scores for the second time in this young season. A nice formation from Brown. They get a lead blocker from Lucier, and for Brown coming on the road, a place they haven't won in a while. Get a turnover, points off a turnover. You couldn't script a better start if you were James Perry on both sides of the ball. But the Bears had to replace Alan Smith, who scored 13 times a season ago. Second team all Ivy running back, and Stockton Owen finally healthy. He is making good. As a replacement, Marin will attempt the point after. And it is good. So Christopher Marin makes it a 7-0 Brown lead. The and this time DePrima to pass, but he's under pressure. DePrima in a bind, and he'll go down. He'll be marked down at the 23-yard line as Brown gets a sack, and it'll be third and long for the Harvard offense. What a great start for Brown's defense. Make the first man miss, but just too much pressure, and that is a facet of the Brown defense. Isaiah Reed, one of the leaders. Two wide receivers in there for Harvard on third and four. McLaughlin trying to get to the 45, and he'll be just shy of it. It was third and four. They needed to. Wilcox sends Golden in motion. Wilcox to pass. He's looking deep, airing it out for West Rocket, and it's caught at the 30. Rocket hauls it in with tight coverage. Woo. My goodness, air it out, Jake Wilcox. This is designed for him to roll out. 50 yards, one-on-one -on -one coverage. He sees it, West Rocket. He's more of the underneath guy, slot wide receiver. If you're Caleb Moody, what else can you do defensively? That is put into a bucket by Jake Wilcox or Wes Rocket. Him think a little bit more, and he enjoys the challenge. Wilcox to the outside, and there's Rocket. He's got a first down. It takes two Crimson to bring him down at the 47-yard line. Wilcox scanning the field. He's had plenty of time. Floats it for Franzioni, who makes a wonderful catch, and he's spun down inside the 40 by Matt Hudson, but not before getting to the Harvard 36-yard line and another big gainer for this Brown passing game. Third and seven. Need to get to the 16 to the outside. It's caught by Walker. He's got a first down and rumbles close to the five. Graham Walker showing the physicality. First and goal for the Bears. Own 44-yard line. They need to get to the 47. Wilcox on fourth down, throws, and it's caught by Pezza. Sliding out to the 48-yard line. Now he rolls to the right. Wilcox, eyes downfield, throws for the end zone, touchdown. Jordan McIntyre, and Brown is back in business. That drive needed to end in points for Brown. It was very eventful. It was methodical marching down the field and through all the chaos, which Brown loves to embrace, it's six. A house call, great job by Jake Wilcox. Off the right, just slowly letting this play develop, and then no one picks up Jordan McIntyre. Sticking out this year, the speed that he has. McLaughlin gets it again, this time left side, but he'll go nowhere. Terrence Lane in on the stop. The left guard, as there's a catch made by Walker. What a grab. On first down, he picks up 11. Who's moved into the offensive line here in Anagonye's spot. Here's another catch, this time on the right side by Rocket. 
shifts his weight and gets to the 48-yard line, a pickup of 12, so two plays, 23 yards for the Brown passing game. Line. Brown is 8 of 15 on third down. A handoff, it's a reverse. Handed off to Samuel Badu. He has the first down down the sideline, and he's out of bounds at the 32-yard line. Will always stick out to James Perry as his team on second and seven will toss this to the left side. It's caught by Owen down the left sideline, and he's out of bounds close to the 10-yard line. And a first down gain out 18 yards. So calm to meter and just see what he did for the safety of this game. Second and goal, Stockton Owen, the direct snap, plows into the end zone. Touchdown, Brown. Once again, Stockton Owen finds Pater, his second score of the night. Finally gets through after that stuff on the first player. He got very close, and if you're Brown from the goal line, you might need that third time out late in this game. You never know, but... Stockton Owen going right to the Brown sideline. A little slam dunk there in front of what is a very spirited crowd that came up from Providence. Hand off Franzoni. He's got the first down wrapped up by Bartram. But not before making his way across the 32-yard line for a pickup. So that takes it close to midfield, 48-yard line. First down catch by Walker. And look at him carry the Crimson defense out across past the 45-yard line. Brown last year was negative 15 in turnover margin. Wilcox throwing left side, caught inside the 15, Rocket. Well, that combo has been there for the long chunk plays for Brown. One-on-one -on -one coverage, corner turning his back. Just looking at Wes Rocket and Jake Wilcox puts it right in a bucket here. Brown looking to score for the third consecutive drive. Here's a throw in Rockets direction again and somehow it's caught. Coming back to the football, Wes Rocket. These hands are elites to take the lead. Lucier into the game, takes the snap, plows forward. No, he gets out to Stockton Owen who fools everybody for a touchdown. A hat trick for Stockton Owen. Stockton Owen just bouncing outside whenever Lucier has been there. They've liked that direct snap look with Lucier being the leading blocker. Seems to be another slam dunk for Stockton Owen.